Sorry I didn't give too much heads up for the voting for the character in this game, but you all did vote. The results are in, and the winner is... Hikaru, of all people! I was actually really wanting to play as Hikaru. Not necessarily for this game, but at least at one point. So I'm kind of glad it won. So that is who I am playing as for Gokujo Parodius. You can also head over to the forum, still, link in the video description, where you can vote on who I'm going to play as in Jikyo Oshaberi Parodius, which is coming up next. You shouldn't even have to register on the forum. It's quite literally click that link and then click on who you want to play as. So without further ado, onwards to the game. Welcome to Let's Play Gokujo Parodius! Direct sequel to the previous Parodius Da. Story-wise, I don't entirely know what's going on. Not important. Now, as has been mentioned, the winner, according to your votes, has been Hikaru! Oh, something else I should mention is, um... Actually, can I back out? Guess not! Guess we're playing manual! Now, something else that I should mention is this game actually introduced other characters in the form of... Give myself two speed-ups here. Now, if you kill this guy, he drops a whole butt-ton! I'm yet to see another one of them actually drop that many. Every other one I've seen so far drops, uh, bells. Uh, I'll take the boomerang shot. Now, the boomerang shot is a... Well, first of all, you'll notice that Hikaru's options do not control like a normal Gradius option. Instead, they actually move in formation behind your player. Which I think is more intuitive for me. I've never been super huge on the Gradius option. Like, neat thing, just not something... Oops. Neat thing, just not something I've ever, like, super gotten into and taken advantage of nearly as well. And holy crap, I, look, I just want to kill you guys. Why is this so hard? Boomerang Shot, of course, is uh, much more powerful than the standard shot. There's a second option here, move it into... Position. Gotta drop a bunch of bells. Holy crap! Hey, a Konami sign. I'm willing to bet that thing is gonna fall. Yeah. Did that fallen thing. I'll go ahead and give myself my missiles. Now, uh, Hikaru's missiles actually move up or down depending on where you are on the screen. However, since they fall from it, the options as well, that actually means you can s essentially float in the middle of the screen, and your upper options will drop bombs up, and your lower options will drop bombs down. Let's go. Um, what I was getting at before, though, is this game introduced... Ah, come to the end of our first... 
having plowed our way through a Kraden game, we come to our first boss. But as I was saying before, this game actually introduced other characters. If you play two-player, the second player plays as essentially a color-swapped version of the, ma the main characters. However, doing that actually... Yep. However, they made that a separate character, kind of like Mario and Luigi. The separate character plays identically to the first, but it is a separate character altogether. I want to say it's in Jikyo Ushaberi Parodius, or whatever it's called. The game that follows this, they actually brought the other characters to life even more. Giving them their own playstyle. Now, the... Game... Game... Vidja game... Vidja Um, when this game was localized... Not localized, ported, I guess I should say. There we go. All four options! Kneel before the bunny-suited lady! Riding a missile! I... I am an advocate of more characters in... I'm an advocate of more characters in video games and anime and everything wearing bunny suits. Um, when the game was ported, though, a couple things were changed about some of the characters' various shots. I know Hikaru's tail gun used to be a kind of carrot shot, I think. Or maybe that was the boomerang shot became a carrot shot. I don't remember. Sad that that's gone. The Cat Battleship Returns! People have said that I should have called it a cattle ship. And that, that doesn't make any sense. The boomerang shot is actually a reference to a game. Maybe it was a salamander. You know, I don't remember. But the boomerang shot is actually reference to something. Oh, are we can even go through the water. Other things of note that changed were. Um, it's some kind of, like, star bomb or something that's harder to... No, I don't want it! No, I still got a carrot shot. Carrot shot will actually do me some good here. Really. Shooting this dude. Maybe I'll just keep my carrot shot for a while. What you gonna do about it, cat? Gonna... Gonna... Hey, that's the... that's the first boss of Proteus Dog. He's still down there. He'll wake up eventually, I'm sure. The carrot shot is certainly not as powerful as the boomerang shot, I'm noticing. No, I had to itch my nose, nobody kill me. Killing, killing. Get, 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 get. Ah, and finally, we can take down the cat battleship. The battle cat. I still got my shield. I got my bunny shield. Aw, oh, did I not kill it? I probably, like, needed the damage from the boomerang shot in order to kill it. All right, going back to the boomerang shot.
the mermaid lady trying to send us as the intrepid adventurers to a watery grave. You and your noble woman's laugh. Ah. Proteus has got a thing for giant women. I'm not entirely sure why. But you know what? It it adds something kinda unique. Now, uh, Goku Joe Parodius is actually a little bit shorter than uh, Parodius Da. It's only seven stages, so I think I'm running calculations through my head as I'm playing. I think this may only be a two-video series. Because we are certainly early enough in. No! We are certainly early enough in to continue on into another stage. You know what? Fudge those power-ups. I didn't like those power-ups anyway. Who needs stronger guns and crap? Oh man, free run. Them, them penguins. Is that even a penguin? What the crap is that? You know, for having, I was gonna say, for having free row, like for turning on free range mode here, they're certainly not trying very hard to give me something to, like, dodge around. Holy crap, man, these boomerangs wreck this stuff! They just friggin' what the crap was that? Silly question, really. This whole game is really what the crap is that the game? It's Parodius. I mean, seriously. Now, when this game was... I mentioned before that this game was ported to the Super Nintendo, and the Super Nintendo is a reasonably loyal port, considering. However, the original version of the game was an arcade game. Whoops. The original version of the game was indeed an arcade game, and I am never getting that power up item. I mean, I guess I don't need it, but... No power up item? No! Eat it! Eat it, tiny version of boss from previous Parodius game! Maybe the bird was the first boss, and the penguin was the I think I got points out of that one. No, s seriously, what is that? It's a- there's a penguin on it. Is it a boat? Whoa! Give, 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 give. Yeah, I, I got no idea what that was. Looks like a boat or something. So got some strawberries everywhere. I will destroy all of the crackers! All of the delicious cake! And that brings us to the third boss. Oh yeah. This boss, a complete shout out to one of the very one of the bosses in Gradius 3. It's retextured, but it has pretty much the exact same attacks. And I just lost my dude. 
Only it's pastry related. Instead of having a core, it's got little dudes inside the mouth. It even shoots the little reflecting lasers that bounce off its bigger lasers. Take my shield. There's nothing you can do about it. Pastry man! Doing the best I can with what I've been given. Well, I took out one of them. You gonna dive me again? Or are you gonna open up? Nope, you're gonna open up. In which case, I am just gonna shoot you. I'm gonna... I killed two of you. Can I kill the third one? Nope! Probably did a fair amount of damage, though. Probably gonna kill him next time. Frickin' lips, man. Maybe this is like a next version of the Lips dude from the previous game? Yeah! Eat it, pastry lips. And I do believe that's round about enough for today, so... Until next time, everyone. When we continue on into Gokujo Parodius.